was the weekend and the first order of business for me was to make sure that I went in and freshened out my braids because they were looking crazy yesterday for the past two days like since my graduation they've just been looking crazy and I have not made any attempts to fix them but this morning I'm like um no today I really look like a hot ass mess express so I'm like let me just fix them up so I look a little bit more presentable especially because I have to go to the Dollar Tree maybe in a hot little minute or so and I don't want to go out there looking crazy plus the hat that I have I'm really tired of it so my hair needs to look okay express hair <laughs> I don't look as terrible today because I made sure that this morning I got up today Saturday by the way is I made sure that I got up and you know refresh my braids a little bit because they were looking kind of crazy I'm not gonna lie and I did not want to go anywhere with them in the condition that they were in I think I'm gonna start tying them down even though I have my hair braided up to pretty much wear my wig I still want them to look presentable in case I want to run to the Dollar Tree and I don't want to wear the wig, which I do. Yesterday I also bought another like cute baseball hat on Amazon because the one that I had was not really doing it. Sis was raggedy, okay? So I made sure that I got another new one yesterday. And what else did I buy? I think I bought two things and I also think I seen the package on the back porch. So I need to go get it. So I bought the baseball hat and I bought something else i can't remember what it is it's small items though oh i bought a foundation and a mascara which will be arriving tomorrow the foundation wait what okay friday when is it going to be delivered the 31st Ugh. i'm getting a foundation tomorrow great love that for me Anyways, I'm getting the hat today. I really thought I was going to get the foundation today, but apparently not. But that's um that's all I ordered from Amazon. That was like 20 something dollars because I really do need a new hat and if I'm going to be wearing my hair, I can't wait for my hair to grow a little bit more. Yes, I said it. I'm not normally excited about my hair growing because it's already so much to do with and I'm pretty sure from the footage you guys seen just now, you realize that <laughs> I make faces when I'm getting my hair together because it's so much especially because it's dry normally i style my hair when it's wet so it's easier to manage which is why i have the spray bottle and i was going in and kind of wetting it up so it's a little bit easier but for the most part i was working with dry hair i was gonna wash it but it doesn't need to be washed and it smells really good so i decided against that i was seeing i can't wait for my hair to grow up a little bit more so um the the end of the braids could be heavier because the longer it goes the heavier this piece becomes so it actually lays nicely like that you know it's not going anywhere obviously i could put some hair on there but to find the color is a whole situation and i don't have the time so i can't wait for it to grow up a little bit more so when i do it like this i can actually wear it out like this or feel more comfortable wearing it out like this because the ends are not gonna like curl up or anything 
which is gonna be dope who knows when that's gonna be but I must say my hair has really been growing so much from where we started out at today what do I have planned for today I don't really have much planned for today I want to go to the Dollar Tree and get a little dollar brush to wash the dishes because the one that I had um I don't have it no more um So yeah, so I want to just run to the Dollar Tree, but that's pretty much all I have to do. But yeah, I'm, I think I'm going to make some coffee right now and continue watching some YouTube videos. So guys, um, now that my hair looks a little bit more put together, my daughter has decided that she wanted to start vlogging. And I'm not going to lie, initially when she said it to me, I'm just like, oh my gosh, what? Why? And I'm that parent who I feel like it's okay to let your kids express themselves in whatever way they want you just need to be there to guide them and I'm just like well she's kind of going off of my example she's seen that I'm vlogging and she wants to do the same thing too so she asked me to show her how to edit so I told her it's a little bit hard for me to teach her how to do it from where we are so she should record the videos and send them to me and I'll edit them and I'll up upload them she decided that <laughs> she wanted the name of her channel to be all things Dijonet <laughs> It just shows that um, whatever I do, she's gravitating towards it so much because the name of my channel is All Things Janine. And I'm just like, oh wow, this is what we're doing, huh? So I'm going to spend the rest of the evening working on uh, uh, working on the channel for her because she said that's what she wants and I promised that. I'd help her to figure it out. So she's gonna record the videos and she's gonna send them to me and I'm gonna edit them and upload them. So I'm gonna be in control of what goes. <laughs> oh, I'm stressed out. I am so stressed out. My daughter wants, <laughs> oh my God. That is it. Um, yeah, so yeah. She already sent me um, clips that I'm trying to put together for her first video and now I'm shaking in my boots. My kid is growing up, she's nine years old and she sounds and looks grown. Shambles.